Hello and welcome to a new series here on the channel, which I like to call Ice and Fire, A Fateful Adventure. Now there's a little bit of a story behind the name there, A Fateful Adventure, but we'll get to that in a short period of time, because first of all, I want to say welcome to this new modded series, where we will be primarily playing with the mod called Ice and Fire, which basically adds a bunch of dragons and other mobs as well and yeah they're deadly but you can also tame them and yeah it's actually pretty cool i haven't played with this mod for yeah not much except for when testing this pack because we do have a few other mods as well but i guess it is now story time to why i'm actually making this so i wanted to make a new series and my bestest friend atalantis really wanted to see me try and play with this mod because on her channel she has a let's play series with this mod as well. I really like the mod, I think it's pretty cool, though I did not have, I do not know much about the mod itself. So I was like, cool, I want to make something with this, but send help, because <laughs> I don't know what to plan stuff. But then I got the idea of, well, basically letting her decide my fate. So that means that from episode to episode, Atalantis, not me, Atalantis will decide what I'm doing in that episode. So I have different quests or tasks per episode that she decides to put me through. It can be deadly, it can, it can be calm, it can be easy, pretty much whatever she feels like doing. And so now here we are in a wonderful Minecraft world here with a couple of mods, one of them is GEI, as we can see here, recipe, ah, that is correct, that is from testing stuff, okay, I think that is good now, yes, so I use this so I can see how to craft things, because I cannot remember it all in my tiny little uh, helmet, so yeah, yeah, I need, I need that, and you know what, let me pull up the mods here real quick. All right, there they are. Now I can see them. We only have a little. We only have a few because I basically want this series to be focused around the Eyes and Fire mod, and yeah, I think it's going to be pretty cool. So let's get started with the other mods, the mods that we have here. Um, we have a mod called Animania, Animania, which basically adds. I think it replaces vanilla cows and chickens and animals like that and replaces them with some fancier ones and some, well, cooler looking ones. So that's pretty cool. Um, we have Bibliocraft, which basically adds, well, shelves and stuff that you can store things on, and also just a bunch of decoration items. And yeah, it's pretty cool, and many of these blocks can be controlled in the world, right? Like, right-click on the shelves to place the item on it. And I really like the idea of that, so yeah, that's cool. Um, we have, let me see here, Gravestone Mod. So, well, Atalanta suggested that I had this because I will probably die a lot. And when I do, I don't want to lose all my items. So yeah, I have that just to make it a little bit easier for myself. Then we got the Ice of Fire Mod itself. Um, we got GEI that I showed you. We got... Up to find, so I can zoom and get up to find. Uh, I don't know what to call it. Optimize, up to find. I don't know. Uh, we get we got Pam's Harvest Craft, which basically adds a bunch of new food. Um, a bunch of new food. If we just go here and search Pam, you can see a bunch. It, it's six pages, and you can see it's a bunch of different foods like sandwiches and stuff. It's so cool. I like that mod, and it also adds a bunch of new plants and such to the world, so that is pretty cool. Um, fruit trees and yeah, it's it's amazing. Uh, then we also got a weather mod, which basically allows, well, rain, clouds, and the, yeah, all of that is way cooler. But there's also tornadoes and yeah, things like that. So that's going to be pretty cool. And yeah, it actually has its own configuration here. I might tweak it. Um, yeah, but I don't think, I think it's fine the way it is. And as for biome generation, we have, we actually have two. We have the main one that is called open terrain generator. And then we have an add-on for that called biome bundle. And this is basically the generation of biome bundle. If I have understood everything correctly. All right, this area looks pretty safe. 
I think this area seems safe-ish. I can go over here to this village. I don't know if... I don't think they have a blacksmith, unfortunately. If they did, that would have been an easier way to maybe get some iron and a, an easier start, but it wouldn't seem like they have that. Now... Ah! Cave! With coal! That's good. Okay, let's head down. Alright, so... Um, each episode, of course, will have quests that Atalaxis will give me. It could be one, it could be more, depending on what they are. And for this episode, I have two. One of them is get settled with a home. Ah, that's iron. I think it's that data in there, actually. Get settled with a home. So I need to get a home base up and running. I need to get a home base up and running. And then I need to find a specific type of ruin structure thing that has a thing called a Gorgon. And I basically need to kill that, she says. So, yeah, this is going to be, to be interesting. And if you want to check out Atlantis. Let's play series with this part as well. Her channel will be linked down below. Um, is this a dead end? Yes, it is. I'm sorry for the darkness. You know what? Let me make some torches for you. Here we go. Torch. And let me put those in my offhand. Sweet. I am right away. Cool. I don't know what I should make with this. Probably a shield or something. I hear some more back there, but yeah, let's not go there yet. Um, four. That's enough for a shield and an iron pickaxe, actually. That's perfect. Um... Yeah, so I need to be doing a lot of searching actually. Uh, this could take <laughs> this could take a lot of time to get this one episode going. I don't know how often I'll do the series, so you'll just have to see when I upload it. Um, yeah, all right. There's not really much for me from this village, I don't think, because the weed and stuff are not grown as much as I would like it to have. So, I mean, there's plenty of books. I can actually with the I see a book. If I press U while hovering, I can see the usages. I mean, there's that, like, Animania manual. Redstone, one in one. Light turn. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> uh, and we'll... Mm. You know what? I won't need any of that right now, I don't think. Um, you know what? Why is there a zombie over there? Zombie? Oh. Ow. Yeah. Yeah. Stop that. Stop that. Oh, more iron. Might as well get it. I'll need it. There we go. Might as well get it. Because I will need it. Especially for armor. These dragons are extremely dangerous and I do not really want to get close to those. Uh, there's some more iron over there. I just want to make sure that we're good. Um, I don't really want to go down mining too much. I need to set up a a base camp. A place to call home. I don't know where I'm going to do that. But... Yeah, I'm not sure where I'm going to do that. I could stay in the village, but then I feel like I need to protect them. So, I might move on, actually, and not stay. Hey, buddy, I would not go down there. I highly suggest that you don't. <laughs> you will die if you do that. Um, yeah, I was going to get some... Depending on how easy is it to get leather. How easy is it to get leather? Not easy. Okay, you know what? I'm sure they'll be fine if I just grab one bookshelf. I'm sure they'll be fine with it. Uh, you guys can have that, I'll have a strawberry. Alright, so I need to find out where to go. So, what direction is this? This is east. kind of want to go up here and see what's on the other side. Also, oh, this is red sandstone. Okay, that's cool. I have not played with this um, biome generation before. And yeah, that's a, that's a cow. Um, yeah. Oh, the sun is going down. Eh? Okay. This could be... A, whoa, okay. Okay. This is a little bit dangerous. Um, not sure how far that goes. How far down. I just though I don't want to fall into it. Uh, oh, a little bit of lag. Okay. Um, yeah, it's getting night time. I might have to stay at the village. I do not... Want to, wow, there's a lot of animals here. That's cool. 
I don't want to be near the village though. Because that will attract monsters. Wait, I see some water over there. Um, I know what I'm searching for would seem to be around beaches. So I would kind of want to go to the water. And see if it just so happens that... Um, yeah, that I'm close to one that is already here. It's probably a little bit too much to hope, but... Hey, gotta try. Also, there's sugarcane and I want it, so... The only hole I failed. Um, yeah. Let me just grab this sugarcane right here. Because I don't know when I'll get more. There we go. I don't know when I'll get more, so I should probably grab some. I should probably find a shelter for the night. I have 79 on me. That's actually pretty good. What is that? That's a that's a some sort of turkey or something. It's a turkey. Um okay, it's just seems like it's just a pond. Um hmm. There's another cave entrance here. That's an abandoned mine shaft. Ooh. Okay. Also sounds like yeah, there's a storm brewing somewhere. Uh oh it, this counts as a base of biome. Right. Gold. Hmm. This is an interesting place to search, because there could be chests on the surface here. I have seen that before. And it's pretty interesting when that happens. Just gotta be careful though. I don't wanna run into a spider spawner this early. There's some iron though, I'll grab that. Oh, there's some more in here. Oh, see what I said? There's a chest. Okay, I want to go slowly. I want to go slowly. Uh -huh. Let's see. Okay, cool. I'll take that. A golden apple. Okay, I'll take the melon seeds and the torches. I don't need the rails right now. That I don't really need. I'll take the iron. Okay, I'm going down. Uh, I, should, I should have proper food on me. I don't. I'm really not prepared for this at all. Okay. I don't think it is the best idea for me to get down here. So, oh, okay, no, 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 that's a spawner, that's a spawner. Okay, I'm staying away from that. That's fire, that indicates a dragon. I'm going in the opposite direction. I don't want to find a dragon right now in this episode. Wait. More fire. Okay, I'm going this direction. I'm going this way. I am going this way. I don't... Okay, that fire is close. There's a dragon nearby. This is... not good for my health. Um, you know what? That village is probably doomed. I would help it, but there is... Uh, yeah, there's a dragon over there somewhere. It is probably hunting as we speak. Probably coming closer to us. Yeah, I think that village is fairly doomed. There's fire over there too. Yeah, I see. You see that kind of like black stuff over there? Yeah, that's from a dragon blast. I need to get going. I need to. I need to move. I can't. I can't make a shelter here. Um, I would like to, but I can't. I really, 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 really can't. Um, yeah, I'm not sure where to go. Need to find, okay, not down there. Need to find a spot to call home, but yet that is safe from dragons. Um, what is that? Okay, I think I'm going, I'll try and go over there. Maybe at least I can, that's a tower. Okay, I'm going to the tower. You know what, that tower might be my home if there's not something nasty close by. Is there any iron on the surface that's easy to grab? No? Okay. Okay, I'm going to this tower over here. Because, um... If I could call that home, that would be pretty cool. Chili paper. Pepper. Paper? Wow. 
Okay, I'm grabbing some of these mushrooms as well, because um, if I can't find any other food, mushroom stew will have to be the way to go. Or fishing, so there's a skeleton right there. I'm get close to that. Get me the string. Might need to make a fishing rod. Okay, you are right there. I shall kill you. Don't want this. Oh, now all those are swarming. You know what? That is probably some sort of dungeon and with a spawner in it. That is not good. The last thing I want, though, is a dragon to be nearby. A dragon nest. That would be extremely bad. I really need shelter for the night. Ah, that's a creeper. He blended in extremely well. Okay. No. Okay. Okay, there are doors here. Okay. That's another creeper. Don't blow up. Please don't blow up. I need this place. I need this place real bad. No. No. Don't you dare. Thank you. Aw. Uh, well, there's an anvil. So, I mean, that's cool. You know what? This, this seems as good of a spot as any. Just a dragon somewhere. I have no idea if it will hear me. But there's a dragon somewhere. Did it just not flew over us? Eh? I really, really don't want to go outside right now. So I'm just going to, I think, make shelter here. So this is not a place, safe spot to be at either, it would seem. Okay. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go off camera for a moment. I will organize my inventory, see what I need, see what I don't need. And then, yeah. I think I'm gonna call this temp. I think I'll have to call it temporary home, and um, yeah, I'll catch you on from there. So stay tuned. I'll I'll be uh, right back. Okay, so I have been doing some stuff. I have been smelting the iron. I've made an iron sword. I made a shield. I made an iron pickaxe. I saved that for when I go need to go mining. I'm right now just waiting for some iron to get ready so I can make a chest plate, and then I'm going into the big tower over here to see if it's a um, place that I can actually, uh, yeah, stay at. If not, well, then I'll probably die in the process. I have no way of setting up my spawn here, so, yeah. Also, I'm going in with an extremely low amount of food, so I'll try and get some of the cows that are close by. Though I am a little bit afraid to go out, because I did hear that dragon nearby. Sorry. Oh dear. Okay. Shield. Shield. Whoa. That thing is tough. Hi, buddy. Question is how tough? Okay. Bleh. Okay. It's just a skeleton. Just a skeleton. No. Thank you. Die. 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 Well, I have a bow and two arrows. You know what? That works. Okay, where's the other cow? Hold on. Need to, uh, get something to eat here. I might need to go above the hill to check if there's anything, if it's safe or not. If there's any, um, dragons nearby. Because... Otherwise, this could be deadly. I'm so sorry. I'm... Okay. I can't kill you. I just can't. Thing is, I don't know if any of these are booby-trapped. Oh. Gold. Okay. I mean, I'll take this. Um, saddle. Manuscript. 
Okay, I guess I'll take that. I guess I'll need it. Um, might as well take the bones. We nah. I mean, I'll take the gold. Why not? Okay, so I think what I'm gonna do off camera is check all of these houses out. Um, yeah. I just gotta remember which one is mine. It's this one with the closed door. Yeah, I'm gonna check. What's that? Okay, that's just normal lava. Okay. I think I'm safe, but I wanna, oh, okay. Um, cool. Um, hopefully the dragons aren't attracted to that. Otherwise I've killed myself, more or less. Ooh, iron. Okay, I'll definitely take that. Nice. I'll take the string, I'll take the manuscript, I'll take this, I'll take the bread, why not? Okay, I'll do some, I'll check the stuff out off camera. Probably even raid the tower off camera, because, like, I'll record it, but I might not show it. Just because... There's a witch there. Just because it's gonna take a while. So, I'll be back once I have something interesting for you. So, stay tuned. All right, I have done work. <laughs> well, a little bit. Anyways, I raided, I think I raided all of the houses here and I actually found a bit and also some armor pieces. I now have full iron armor. Um, I found some more iron ore and iron in the chests and the furnaces. It turned out that the furnaces down there actually had some gold and glass in it, so I took those. I moved the anvil up here and well, this is what I got so far from we started to now, I think even though Atalantis requested that I went for a Gorgon in the first episode, I think I might have to talk to her about maybe waiting with that till episode 2. Mainly because this has taken up a lot of time so far and I want to be able to do things without being in a rush. So I think we might have to do that. Um, let me just grab this iron here. I was not supposed to grab this, but let me just grab it before we get into the tower. If the tower is cool and clear and we can clear it, I think I might take it as a home, but let us first get um, behind the hill up there and just check that there isn't a dragon's nest thing, whatever you want to call them, behind there, because that could be bad news for us. Because um, I did hear one. I did hear a dragon. So I just want to be sure that there isn't something and the reason I actually went, I actually waited till nighttime so I could sleep so that I would be sure that I could actually spawn here and get my stuff back just in case. Now there are animals up there and I'm pretty sure if there had been a dragon I'm pretty sure they would have been dead by now but who knows. I also see another village thing whatever you want to call it right over there. Yeah, right there. So that's a potential place that I can loot. Okay. No, I think we're clear. I think we're good. I see some ruins over there which I would like to check out eventually. Um, I see some sand. I actually see another ruin over there that's actually from a village. That could be bad. That could be really bad. Alright, so I just screenshotted the coordinates to here, just in case I need to be able to find my way back here if I get lost. Um, I'm just exploring the surrounding area for any dragon um, places, because if there is one... Is that a dragon shooting? No, I think it's just particles from this flower which I don't like. Okay. I think we're good, to be honest with you. I think we're actually good. Um, that is just in another abandoned structure. So I think we're good to enter the tower. I don't see any dragon infested area anywhere. Um, I did hear one, though. That's what worries me, but it might just have flown by. I don't know. It could also have been friendly. Maybe I think some of the dragons are friendly. I'm not sure. Anyways, let's get into this tower. I've spent long enough. 
Um, yeah, waiting. So let's eat. All right, let's go. Sealed up. Let's go in. I see cobweb. I don't like this. Okay. Okay, there's a trap door leading to a basement. Uh, cobweb. Okay, you know what? Cool. Leave that for after. Okay. Torches. I don't like staircases like this, because you never know what will be there waiting for you. Okay, so it's just going up. I can see another hatch up there. It could be clear. I don't know. But... I want to make sure. Okay. This seems clear so far. Okay. Okay. It's just a place with a chest, a gold ingot, and an iron pickaxe. And nothing more to it than that. You know what? I kind of like this place. Let's go down into the basement and see what's up down there. And see if it's safe or... What was that? That was a cobweb. I definitely need to do some cleaning if I'm moving in here, which I think I will. Because, if I'm being honest with you, I quite like this place so far. And I think it will be a cool place to stay. If this is blocked. There we go. Fine. Okay. This could be the dangerous part. Let me just take that, that one block and place a torch. Okay, hold. Why is that just cobblestone here? Why is that just cobblestone? I don't like this. That's just cobblestone. Oh. I think this is actually just the foundation of the... Of the... Of the tower. You know what? This could be... Very well just be a... Um... Error in the... In the generation of the world. So I think I'm actually gonna take this place as a home. Let me just take out this and see if we can find anything. I have found something. Aha! There's a chest here. Maybe you're meant to be searching for it. I don't know. Could be. Alright, let's see what's in it. Some iron. Alright. I'll keep digging. Aha! There's another chest here. Yeah, this could require some excavation to dig this entire basement out, but you know what? I like it so far. I could live down here. Bread. You know what? That's actually pretty good. Um, yeah, I could I could live down here. Alright. Uh, anything of interest in this direction, though? I'm assuming the cobblestone is the border of this place, so... I think this is the end of it. Unless there's some secret door over here that I haven't seen yet. Let's place a torch right there. Don't think there is, though. Yeah, I think we're pretty good. Alright, I think I have gotten all of this excavated out. And you know what? I like it down here. It is nice, safe, I hope, and secluded. And yeah, I, I like it. Oh, it's getting dark, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, it is. Uh, can't put this. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna head over to my home over here. Yeah. And get my stuff. Sleep. Get my stuff. Actually, I would like to sleep at the new place to get my spawn reset. Um, you know what? I'll take this chest with me at another time. Let me just take some of the stuff that I might need with me. Um, book, maybe, the apple, the glass I might need. Um, yeah, I think... I think this is good for now. Uh, let me grab the furnaces as well. Let me grab the bed. Okay, I think that's everything from this place. Oh, and the anvil. What can I drop? What can I drop? One granite. I think that can stay. Um, okay, yes, let's move. Let's run. 
If I hear a dragon now, I'm gonna be so spooked. Ah, there's a zombie guarding my entrance. Thank you, but I did not hire you to stay here. Okay. Eh, get up. Get up. Get up. Eh. I need a real door. I need to move some stuff around. I don't like this entrance whatsoever. Also, I'm closing this. Okay. I think we are good, though. I think we're good. Let me just sleep. And we should be safe. Okay. Yes. Yes, we're good. Alright. Let me find out what to do now. Hold on. Alright guys, I think we're gonna call it an episode here. We didn't go after the Gorgon yet. We will do that in the next episode. I need to get organized. I have so much stuff I need to organize. I might do some mining. I might create a mine shaft somewhere. I don't know. Um, but yeah, I need to I need to organize my stuff and inventory and it's a mess. It's everything. It's a mess. So yeah, I need to I need to get organized. Organized. I need to yeah get that stuff sorted and then we'll go and kill a gorgon in the next episode. I have no idea what it is, but it should be doable. So yeah, we should be able to do it. We actually have a lot of iron. That's actually really nice. I might go mining between episodes and get ready. Maybe farm some stuff. I don't know. But anyways, that's gonna do it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you were excited about this new series. If you are, be sure to leave it a like and share it with your friends and subscribe if you haven't yet and enable those, blah, blah, blah. And enable those notifications because uh, then you'll get notified when I upload stuff and go live. So yeah, you should do that. And also, you should follow me on Twitter and join my Discord server, link down below. And also follow me on Twitch for streams that are not Minecraft. So yeah, that's that. I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you in the next episode. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.